Jörg Rochel joins us now from the European School of Management and Technology. Thank you very much for coming in. We heard there from an entrepreneur, first of all, that the people who need these loans still can't get them. Why then the interest rate cuts? Well, the ECB hopes that with the interest rate cuts, uh, it's getting easier again for banks to finance themselves and thus to pass on lower interest rates to their customers. Mm. Two problems, though, arise. The one is that many of these customers still often have problems, so uh, they are just not sound enough yet to actually receive loans. And the other one is that the banks are not sound enough, so they, even if they wanted to, they couldn't pass on these loans to their customers. Is it more of a move to also encourage investors? Because at the moment, the stock market has, has jumped up. We saw that last week. This is certainly a side effect of this, because if the interest rate environment is so low, then the alternatives are rare and uh, stock markets are probably one of the few alternatives we have, probably apart from real estate. So how would you say lenders can be encouraged to support smaller businesses, the ones that really need the support at the moment? The key issue remains um, the uh, restructuring of the banks. Many banks are still in deep trouble and these banks uh, need to be uh, resolved, uh, restructured. Uh, some, uh, somehow there also might be um, a need for additional equity injections. So banks just need to become solvent and uh, sustainable again. What about the savers? Uh, at, at the same time as taking out loans, you know, people will love this news. What about those who've just got their money parked at banks and hope that they'll get some sort of return on it? Because if we take a look at the benchmark interest rate for the Eurozone, it wasn't all that bad back at the beginning of 2008. It's only gone down from there, though. And with rates so low, it's not the best time to be a saver, is it? No, for savers, it's really um, a really bad time. Um, so savers necessarily need to look for alternatives. And this may actually uh, be uh, the reason for the stock market increase. Okay, Mr. Rojo, stay where you are. We'll get back to you in a minute.